All right. Hello, hello everybody. Hello. How are y'all doing today? Here we go. Berserk. 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 Volume 36. Boom. The beginning 36. of the Fantasia arc. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, cover We're art and inside it. art. Are all good, good or... to go. Okay. Uh, we can double check with everyone there before we yeah. go into that and stuff. But uh, yeah, doing pretty well. How about... Uh, how about you guys? Good to see you all here. Roxlene, Faux Bones, Anonymous. Gabriel Braga, our Gabriel Braga. Sam. Bowsette is thick. Uh. <laughs> exactly. How are you? Fine. Thank you. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Hello, 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 hello. Awesome. It's got to get to. Oh. Okay. Boy cool. looking. Boy looking. Uh, boy looking angry. Check yeah. that out. His hair products are still, you know, mm -hmm. pretty good. They they missed yeah. a spot, you know, regularly, but yeah. Wow. Volume thirty six, Jacob. Mm hmm. We're so close. So close. So and close. then and then it's then it's gonna be there's gonna be nothing left 100 percent prepared for the best manga uh, the best manga you talking about talking about this are you talking about something that comes after this <laughs> they're talking about um uh i need to think faster in order to make these jokes <laughs> yeah don't you guys talking about something don't you guys hate it when that happens when you realize that you have a great joke but your brain is slow just, at like that random moment so you're like why you why can't i be funny it, now and then, and then why do i have shorts to? out and it's not working yeah <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah we're going from boats to boats ha 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 Although no you guys, manga. You guys do right. realize though thinking. right there's three more volumes of berserk we're reading after this one right yeah seven eight nine boom yep 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 Mm hmm. Oh boy. <laughs> yes. Anonymous. None just, piece. Yes. Just bought a volume of Attack on Titan, which covers everything in Ooh. the end of this season. Till the end of this season. Cool. Yeah, get, get rid of that. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. Yeah. Get rid of that. Yeah. yeah. Um, but yes, oh boy, it's this season of Attack on Titan. But Berserk. Mm hmm. Berserk. Please do volume 40. Well, like, we don't have volume 40. Exactly. So. Kind of tough. Yeah, kind of tough to do that. So, yeah. All right. A lot of this has been building up to kind of this this big shift in the world. But since we saw basically, what was it called? Falconia? Yeah. Yeah, the new city that Griffith had basically risen oh up out of the depths. Well, no, the old city more that Griffith had risen out of the depths. Something, yeah. Uh, to prepare basically for this this great time. Uh, we've just been seeing Guts and company dealing with ghost pirates. Yeah. And old mm -hmm. gods, old ones. Right, stuff. but not so, nearly as old ones as what Griffith has dealt with. So I mean, that's good at I least. Mean, it's pretty old old Well, ones. yeah, yeah, yeah. The sea's pretty unknowable, you know. It's kind of got that. That's true. They did literally call it an old god, too. That, yeah. There is that. <laughs> yeah <laughs> so there's that mm -hmm. oh yes uh the the chapter for those of you that are doing things online uh it's chapter 316 mord tirit thank you so much for yes passing along that info mm -hmm. the online people oh yeah we got mods we got plenty of mods oh, we the got hammer mods. is ready <laughs> mods are here mods are here uh sunny or seven honey thank you so much for the follow glad to have you yes. here thank you print out the online scans staple them together boom volume 40 <laughs> future time traveler or could you perhaps be a future time traveler <laughs> is this the work of an enemy stand oh my god <laughs> all right griffith is playing god guts is playing privateer <laughs> yeah I mean, it's true. It's true. Privateers are great at that, attacking. You know, in a in a civilization without making the other nation automatically go to war with you. You know. Uh, oh, oh I that... forgot. Yeah, you didn't play as much Civilization as I. No, did. not as much. Like, That's I mean, right. I, I played a decent amount of three, but but not too much. Okay, gotcha. Not too much. Humphrey Bogart with the one hundred bits. Hey guys, just wanted to know your thoughts on what Griffith's goals are now, given that he has now created his own kingdom. Well, Zawarudo. 
his goals are to, I would say, solidify that. Yeah, kingdom. exactly. It's just more of what he's already done. You know? Yeah, and then I think that the, the, the grand goals overall has not changed, so... Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. But All right, so let's get into this uh, volume. But, oh, first... But before first, we do that... We've got to... Uh, we have an appointment to keep. Yes. With yes. the power of music. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. And put our grasses on. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Let's yep, do we're still this. not stopping. Oh, yeah. oh, why would we? Exactly. Why yep. would we? Down, 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 whatever holds you back i can't i can't get it off tell me what tell me what tell me what you want i don't know why don't know why don't know why you're afraid tell me what tell me what tell me what you say i don't know why don't know why too late it's too late you know one of these times jacob we should basically have the whole thing playing on our headphones oh and then that way we can make sure we're actually going at the right tempo. I think we would do worse because then we wouldn't hear ourselves. No, no, I think we would do better because yeah. if you think about it, we could be doing worse right now and we just don't know about it. Yet. We could. We could. That's yeah. that's true. Yeah, it's very that's possible. True. Ugh. Ugh. Exactly. No! no! The volume! Come back to me! Come back! It, it fell into hell. No! Yep. All right, all right. Because as you know, below this point, nothing exists. Yep. Huh, you guys are way fast. The OP is really slow. I could see I that assume that is, that is very true, yes. Oh, my gosh. Uh, All right. <laughs> Ruined. All right, and the inside art here, Jacob. Ooh, oh, we have the Berserker Gatsu armor. Batman. Like, I mean, okay, look at the helmet, though. I'm Gutsman. <laughs> like, like, the helmet and the nose and the ears and, like, the mm -hmm. way it comes down on the neck part and stuff. It's, it's it's Batman. It's good. It's ba It's amazing. Oh, Aww. the other piece of art. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, wow. This is truly an anime. The color of their hair and everything. Yeah, I, I, I keep know. forgetting about that. Yeah, she has you know, green hair. Right, right. And this lady has blue hair. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, okay. uh, Isma. That's right. Isma. Uh, right. Not Isma. Yeah. Isma. Isma. What? <laughs> um, what does it say for her? Because this is the first a time girl we've had fisherman one. who lives on the island, who lives on the island of the sea god, treated like an outcast by the village there. She yearns for the outside world and displays a keen interest in stories told by Isidro and Shirka. Yeah, it totes the god. I mean, mm -hmm. wait, did that actually get confirmed last volume? I don't believe so. No. Guts and crew were forced to dock in an island where legends of a sea god and marrows mm. persist. But it was a monstrous place where the inhabitants had been transformed into tentacles by the sea god. Yep. The god who was overwhelmingly powerful, having even turned a pirate ship into a tentacle. And Guts had no choice but to once again don the berserker armor. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she's a marrow, exactly. Yeah, she mm -hmm. is not an avatar of the, right. of the god, exactly. Yeah, and whether that's true or not is unknown. Right. Uh, yeah, I assume it's right. true. All right. Here we go. First chapter. Full Moon, part one. Cool. Oh. Wolf howling. Menacing. Oh, there we Is go. That a JoJo's reference. Oh, did, did you do Isma or did uh, I do Isma? I believe I did Isma. And I have a lot of trouble differentiating between Isma, Farnese, and Shirka. I mean, I. I wow. Think... Would you look at that? You were right, Isidro. Monsters really do exist. Hey. The shock wears off. Hey, the shock wears off eventually. I wonder if the villagers are okay. You're worried about them? Aren't they a bunch of creeps? Well, yeah, they are. But that doesn't mean I've ever wanted them dead. Oh. oh. <laughs> okay, next page. 
It's Isma, Isma the Outcast, Isma the Marrow Girl. Oh boy. They're brats from the village. We've had our share of scuffles. Hey, you guys okay? No, don't go near those. Come, oh. come join us. Oh my gosh. We'll I make thought... you one of us. But they looked so normal a second ago. Right? <gasps> and a Sidro. Sidro kick. And slice with the fire. Now the question fire is, does he blood. have his uh, dagger back? He does. Oh, right, because the they, they got it back to him, yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, next page here. Ooh. Oh. <laughs> Shirka is all spells, spells, spells. <laughs> right? Yep. Tentacles, tentacles. And they're done. Look at those things cook. Are they edible after all? <laughs> Because it's a full moon. Well, what are those? They're what little is left of anyone consumed by those beasts. Unfortunately, I perceive no human presences in that village. Aside from our companions, I fear the villages are all. Yeah. Well, that was why Isma. Well, then why was Isma the only one spared? Opposite side or not, she's. Oh, wait. Uh, that's still a syndrome. Oh, is it? Opposite side or not, she's still on the same island. The power of the amulets. I cannot explain in, in detail. That would take too long. This is a manga. Yes. <clears throat> but I did sense a strong, the, a strong power coming from the, the amulet surrounding your home. That is no doubt what shield, what shielded you from evil all this time. Hmm. Yeah, but still, this is so... I didn't like them. In fact, I hated them. There's... There have been times when I wish they were all gone. But now what? I, I truly am all alone now. Hmm. Hmm. All right, next page. Mm. Nine dots. kind of gives her a look. Isma, you wait here. I'm going to go help my guys real quick. I'm coming too. It's too dangerous for regular folks. <laughs> Even if they have turned into monsters... You're better off not watching the people you knew getting hacked up. Mm. <clears throat> Isidro, <laughs> you should think twice. <clears throat> At this point, you'd only get in the way down there. <laughs> I was being nihilistic and you ruined it! <laughs> what, is, what is Puck saying? Puck is just... just <clears throat> Puck is just like, like barely holding in his laughter at Isidro's <laughs> just ridiculousness. Uh... Guts has gone berserk, and he's fighting those monstrous beasts by himself right now. Approaching without caution would be dangerous. You mean when he... Oh, wait. Oh, you mean when he flips out? Oh, wait, no, no, that, that was, was, was Shirka yeah, this whatever. whole time, whatever. You mean but, when he flips out? But didn't... Did, oh, wait, no, ah. but, didn't, but didn't he figure out how to get a handle on that at the Vertanis Harbor battle? Guts was able to maintain his awareness that time because I happened to be on his back and was drawn into the armor with him. Well, what do we do? I will possess him using my luminous body and try to call out to his consciousness. Our bodies will fuse and... Wait, no. You're gonna do that again? Yeah, yeah, fine. Uh, Out-of-body experience. <laughs> Please guard my body for the time being. And then she's saying, say what? <laughs> say what now? And no... <laughs> And no graffiti? <laughs> and no graffiti. No, because no graffiti oh, on right. sheer cut. Because they, they didn't want her <laughs> yeah, to be, right. people be able to be drawing uh, on yes, her body and stuff yes. like that. Can you feel it? The sensation of the deaths caused by hiatus around you? While mm -hmm. you read this volume, that took a lot to come out. That took... While you read this volume, that took a lot to come out? Oh, I don't get it. Your journey is already passing through many corpses. May all of us here not become one of them. Ah. Mm. Uh, Yes, 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 I see. And uh, Shirka enters her luminous form and goes over to Gatsu. Gatsu, Gatsu. And the doggo is rejecting her. Ooh. Ah! Shirka! What's wrong? The armor is even more powerful than before. It's getting too strong and odd. It's emitting too strong and odd. Blech. I can't get through. It's a guts. All right, to guts page. is guts. Oh. oh, that's cool. The armor is eating a tentacle eye thing. They're like, eating her, and then they're going to eat me. Oh, my God. 
That's nasty. He's fighting even more fiercely than last time. He really is like a beast. Cuts. <clears throat> Yar. But we've sent so many of the brethren after him. <clears throat> what is he? What is that guy? This was supposed to be our feast, but he's making a bloodbath of us. What do we do? How, how should I know? He's biting his face. Oh my gosh. Okay. Just, <laughs> slice, slice, slice. Oh, what's Casca doing? Casca! Lady Far. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, what? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Whoa, hold on. What just happened? Oh, hold, hold on a second. So, that's obviously Guts of the Berserker armor just smashing that thing there. Mm -hmm. And then, uh oh, Lady Farnese! Casca! And then Casca just kind of jumps into the midst of it here. But because he's. Because the Berserker armor is just enraged by, like, just anything oh, that moves. Oh, he just notices them. He just them. noticed them. Crap. Crap. Okay, next page. <sighs> Sees them like shadows. Oh no. Oh, Farnese pulls out a dagger and slices the tentacle monster. Oh, blood. Casca! Huh? A child? D did a villager survive? Ooh. Oh. Nope. Oh. Oh, crap. Ew. Oh God, that's not good. That's this. Casca. All right, next page, and, and boom! Guts in the berserk armor, just, just full page panel. Damn. Oh my God! Wow! Nice. <laughs> wow! <laughs> nice, nice. Guts just bisected it. Did he protect Casca? Does that mean he's in his right mind? Don't approach him! Alright, next page. Hey, uh, still alive, huh? Oh, wild! He sliced up that monster in no time flat! Mistress! <clears throat> Serpico! <clears throat> hey, you okay? That guy just flew! <laughs> Don't go near him. He has not yet returned. Now what? What do we do? <sighs> oh boy. Oh boy. Enemy. Oh. No. Fear. Madness. Sanity. Semblance of sanity. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Violence. Peace. Slay. Protect. Kill. No. Sir. Surrender. Surrender. Yield yourself. Oh, that's oh, a picture right there. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's this a thing is huge. Wow. Look. Focus your gaze here. Look. Whoa. And then a hand reaches through. Light. Okay. Okay. Oh, dang. This is not. Okay. This is not Shirka. No, and it's. Not and it's not Casca not either. Not Casca. Is that is this the, 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 the kid? Well, but the kid got is it like the spirit of the kid or something? Yeah, the maybe. Kid got used for Griffith. This whole thing. It's just such a cool picture of the dark and then the light there. Okay, I guess we're going Wait. to the next chapter. Oh, wrong voice. Oh, the voice is the kid. <laughs> Wait. Oh, oh, on the last part there. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> Look. Sure. Whoa. Okay, next one. Full Moon Part 2. Whoa. That's right. Next page. Whoa. Okay. You know this. You mustn't lose it. You mustn't destroy it. Change. <laughs> 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 and all simultaneously, Gats! Gats! And then crazy scared guy. What's happening to him? <laughs> Next page. Oh, man. He's resisting the armor's odd. Now's my chance. And she's out. Mistress! Check! Oh. <clears throat> wait, wait, wait. 
was she thinking? Shirka! Oh, oh she actually ride. like piggybacked right onto okay. him. Yeah. Okay. Don pile him! I mean, it's <laughs> probably not that detailed, you know. <laughs> Really fade. Well, you know, who knows? They just use that a lot of times for the wine. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes, flying tackle indeed. All right, next page. Guts is getting pulled out. All right. I like how similar. <laughs> oh, yeah, go, I mean, she's go pulling on. by that, but I mm -hmm. like how similar this is also to the uh, whole idea of the um, uh, in Spider Man, the, uh, the symbiote. Oh, gotcha. Sure. Now, I know mm -hmm. Spider-Man is an old comic and stuff mm -hmm. like that, but I wonder if there was some influence by the idea of that, just in the way sure. it's kind of pulling off and leaving all this goop and stuff. Well, now, and I'm sure if this was colored, it would look red, because this is probably blood in a lot of ways. But yeah, Venom. Yeah, exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Zaldrin to the 100 bids. Thank you so much. Sorry, I can't make it today, guys. I got impromptu D&D &D tonight. Ooh, hey, well, have, have fun. fun. Yes. Yeah. D&D &D is awesome. The power of that. protect compels you. Right. <laughs> oh. Mistress. You idiot. Oh, wait. No, no, no. That's that Serpico. You idiot. That, or that was too dangerous. Ow. You might have got cut in half. You might have gotten cut in half. His reflexes are way beyond yours. Stupid Shirka. Stupid Shirka. <laughs> nice choke, sleeper hold. <laughs> <laughs> I'll second that. Never do anything that crazy again. <laughs> you of all people have no right to talk guts. Oh my gosh, she's doing the pout there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> And look at, look at, look at, now we have I I Valera and, uh, and, and oh, Puck. And they're she's fighting. got Puck in a choke and hold. she's got Puck in a choke hold, and yeah. Puck is like, ah, ah. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's great. Symbiote first appearance was in 1988. Gotcha. Okay, gotcha. Yeah. So that would be, I think, before, before Berserk? Pretty sure. Oh, well, certainly before this part. Before this part, yes, for sure. But I'm wondering if it was before Berserk even started. Um, I would say probably not, but not necessarily. Maybe by, probably by a little bit. Probably Because the okay. anime was in 97, so the manga okay. had probably been going on for a while. Or yeah. not that long. You saved me, though. I owe you one. Well, it was the only thing for me to do as a magic user. You owe her a lot more than just one. Go on, say you'll take care of her the rest of... <laughs> if all of us still ships mm -hmm. them. Oh my god. I'm not sure what happened, but it was cool. You're so brave, Shirka. You lost every single chance to look good. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Freaking puck. The monster situation looks mostly resolved. I don't see that pirate ship around. It sure makes a quick getaway for a slug. Mm -hmm. And I'm again amazed at how superhuman he is. It's hard to tell which side's more monstrous. He's more powerful by himself than an entire warship. Still, why do you suppose Casca went running off like that? Oh, Good she's question. hugging the kid. Oh she's hugging my the god. Kid. Yeah. Oh my god, no, it's it's yeah, it's yeah, the uh -huh. kid. Right. The the the, the moon kid Whoa. or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yep. Whoa. yep, yep, yep. Oh. I love any time Berserk gets, like, mysterious. Like, even in the slightest. It's just like... Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> no. Yep. Oh. Oh, dang. Mm-hmm. Wow. Oh, it's a boy. <laughs> <laughs> yes. This is true. You. Say what? We saw him that time at the shore. What are you doing here? You know him. Yes, we met him on our journey before we reached Ratanis. Is this a coincidence? He sure is pretty. But why is he naked? Mm. Nudity's best for your health. Mm. <laughs> and then it just shows Puck nude. Yep. <laughs> oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. Wow. Oh my god. Oh yeah, that's right, full moon. Yeah. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Oh boy. Alright, next page. 
There was a full moon the last time he appeared, too. Nights with full moons have very deep magical significance and are full of magical power. He's appeared now during two of them. How could I fail to notice he was here until just now? Although, I can hardly sense the mysterious odd and hostility from that time. Mmm. Yeah, and Guts, uh... Mm -hmm. Thinking on that. Did you... do that? Oh... Are you from this island, then? I can tell you, I've never seen him. Here, put this on. The sea breeze will chill you to the core. Um, uh, I'm Isma. Who is this girl? I live on the other side of the island. I made friends with Isidro and Shirka a little while ago. But as it turns out, I'm the, the last person on the whole island. Nice to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you make her say that? Gee, thanks. Gee, thanks. Damn it, sir! <laughs> huh? It's it's my fault? <laughs> hey, Captain. Can she come aboard your ship? Hmm. It's cool, right? <laughs> She's just one more person, or what? You're gonna leave a kid here alone in this monster's nest? Is that how heartless the ETH Navy is? <laughs> is it ETH? Yeah, ETH. it's ETH. ETH Navy is? You the same as those pirates? <laughs> and maybe how he punches him, he just kind of goes, yep. no, talk to the hand. I'm, <laughs> right. I'm, I'm sorry. Like, you, you don't get to just do that. Uh, you may 578, thank you so much for the follow. Glad to have you here. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't mind your guest. This is my guest. Well, I don't mind. Your guest is my guest at this point. A generous... Uh, no, that's... Did you? No, I, th I think that's the other guy. That's that's Isidro. No, I think it's actually him. Okay, I'll do it. <laughs> a generous captain's a good captain. Good news, huh, Isma? Anyway, you better come with us now. We can figure out later whatever's next. Leave the island? What? You don't want to? Huh? No, it's not that. I I'm just surprised. I've always wanted to go on a big ship like that. Awesome, it's an adventure! All right, we'll just finish temporary repairs and get the hell away from this place. Right, uh, back to the swaying bed. Guess it's better than sleeping forever here. Not so, not quite so fast. There's still something we need to do. What? You're, what are you saying? If we don't hurry, more monsters will come. There's no guarantee you killed them all here. True enough. We'll be helpless if they attack at sea, and we can't afford to wait for the morning sun. That's true. We'll settle things here at the island. We are at the spawn point, so yeah. let's take care of it permanently. Exactly. Next page. But how? We don't know where their nest is. Yes, we do. I know where it is. That cave? That's the one. But but if we stay here, the ship will still be attacked eventually. <laughs> hmm. I have a plan to deal with that. See, I'm a wizard, and I'm useful. Yep. Could we all go back to the ship for now? We also need to prepare before you march off into the enemy territory, Guts. You got it, Spellcaster. <laughs> And, oh, the kids and they're just, just looking at each other. Mm -hmm. yep. Stare. Stare. <laughs> yep. Mordell with the 100 bits. Like Barrett from Final Fantasy VII A Bridge. We are not taking another ND underage, uh, uh, un underage female party member. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. <laughs> well. <laughs> well. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh. Oh, that, yeah. Oh, okay, but then the kid looks away. Oh, the kid looks away, yeah. Okay, it's a lot of stuff being yeah, said here. Yeah. Puck's like, sleeping in a stable bed sure was a brief dream. No. Sorry, Betchy, did you miss me? Oh. Uh, didn't it get smashed like an egg? You have to get used to it eventually. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, I wonder how, how many fish you can load into a ship that, that huge. Try and find out. It's full of smelly guys now anyway. Well, I beg your pardon. <laughs> of course he would object to that. 
And blood and carnage and gatsu. Wait, are these things sealing up, or are they just being shown as basically having their... Because it looks like they're shifting or moving. Uh, yeah, it looks like they're moving. Yep. Uh, oh, boy. Uh, tentacles and eggs and weird mm -hmm. bulbous things. And, ugh. Okay, so they head back to the ship. What's up? What are they going to do? Um, why must it be out here? This is the best spot because it's so close to the center of the ship. Okay. Uh, what are they going to do? They're going to cast a spell to protect the ship. Does that mean we'll get to see Shirka's magic? N no, not quite. I will cast the formation of the four? Again. Farnese. Again? How can a Ventimion be some kind of witch? But it's so sudden, I, I cannot, mistress. I've never cast a single... Calm down. I now must become luminous and go with Guts to meet the enemy. Oh, okay. Ah, so gotcha. she has to stay here and protect and maintain the barrier, basically. Makes sense, makes sense. All right, next page. If the enemy comes and attacks during that time, you, as a mage, must be the ship's key defense. Key defense? Mage? Me? You'll be okay. The formation, of, the formation of the four is powerful, but it's one of the most basic spells. It's an ideal choice for your first time. You'll have no trouble now that you've harnessed your luminous body. Focus and have faith in your training. I will, of course, guide you through the ritual. Hmm. Farnese and Guts having uh, a little bit of a look and stuff. But all I right. Think, I think, you know what that is? Because the way she's, she's never looked this sternly at Guts, I think what it is is basically her saying, look, I'm being, I'm being really helpful here. Like, okay, like, sure. Like, like you can, you can rely on me, Guts. Sure. I hope it works well. Okay, if Alara, you, you, you got, got it. it. Uh, even with those, the, even with really those small cards, text. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, go for it. It's really small. Even with those cards up, won't the directions change if the ship moves? Mm -hmm. Can I watch? I'll keep quiet. Yeah. Hey, this ain't some show. Wow. This ain't a free show. Pay up. <laughs> oh my god, Buck. Buck's yeah, still like asking for text. tickets and stuff. I guess we don't have much choice. And then uh, Shirka again. Uh, the once, last one. Once the spell is fully in effect, the caster needs to only maintain her subconscious bearings. Cool. Basically, right. you just need to maintain concentration. You'll right. Be fine. This is a very simple thing. Yep. Cast it, takes one action, maintain concentration for 10 rounds, 10 minutes. Or yep, exactly. 100 rounds or whatever. Slow jam too with the 100 bits. It's hard to see, but Guts makes guts makes nods at Farnese for reassurance. Oh, awesome. Cool. Um, oh, yeah, those little lines for, like, The little motion. lines on the right. Yes, yeah. that's right. Mm -hmm. for, for motion. Gotcha. So he's encouraging her as well. Yeah. Okay, cool. All right. Now, as always, we synchronize our rhythms. I am a mage. I am the key defense. Oh, I love it. Okay. I love it. I love the idea of also there being the tether, the line, right. connecting from their heads. To Don't let it get cut. Body. Yeah. All right, next chapter. Beastman. Wait a minute. Haven't we had Beastman before? Like way so. back when. Way Maybe. back it probably, when. It was probably different. It was probably something related to Wild, though. Okay, gotcha. That that's probably something like that. Okay. What? Uh. Um. Something about uh. Right, the nods. Yep. Mm -hmm. Pulling up guts and Casca's childhood pictures and compare the two. What? Oh, theories that the 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 moon child might be like a grown up version of. The their child yeah yeah that makes sense oh blessed king of the east whose spirit rises over the mountains as a zephyr and whose golden raiment gleams like the sun i've never before felt such an enormous power oh blessed king of the west whose name trembles even the water spirits who caper beneath the waves such enormous emotion such an enor enormous existence oh blessed king of the south Brilliance greater than everlasting flame is thy majesty. I feel how small a thing I am. O blessed king of the north, it is for thy rule that all living beings of the earth rejoice. Cool. I feel 
How enormous. Ve, Gepla, Ate, Ve, Gedula. The thing is which I am a part. Of which I am a part. Mm -hmm. Whoa, double pager. Holy crap. This is a simple spell, by yeah, the way. This is a this is a good starter spell. It's a really small starter spell, you know. Yep, it's not yep, mm -hmm. not anything crazy. It's just a little cantrip that requires concentration. You know, That's first right. level spell. <laughs> Aslan, Aragorn, Oberyn, John, help me. Ha! <laughs> wow. No, <laughs> oh, what's that? What's happening? What the? <laughs> what's? Oh wait. <clears throat> what's? <laughs> Look at that wild stuff. Looks like she pulled it off. Are you sure? And <laughs> wow. Well done, mistress. Nice one. The ritual was the spell successful. Look around. Wow. What's this light? Is it an aurora? Is it an aurora? I've never seen it. I've never seen its like. Yeah, it's probably just other people. Oh, well, okay. I I did this? Now that's something. I've sailed all over the world and I've never seen such a thing. You mean you did this? We, may we, might, we might make money with this in ceremonies. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> God, this is this is horribly small text. This is like this is like size four font. Yeah. It's dozens of Hold times. Hold it low so you can see with the light. Trust me. No, no, it no, no. It's it's fine. I need it to be close. Oh. It's dozens of times brighter than a fishing light. Uh, yeah. Then all the rest is. Yep. Okay. Yep. Okay. Hey, your party rank keeps getting lower and lower. <laughs> <laughs> well, so what? It's not like you can expect women and children to swing swords around. Wow. Wow. Wait, is Sidro... Women and children. How old are you, Isidro? Yeah. Yeah. What do you 12? think you are? Like. Yeah. <laughs> Congratulations, Lady Farnies. Serpico, that, that was splendid. Now you can truly count yourself among the ranks of the ma of the Magi. That's pretty good for your first try, uh, but don't let it go to your head. Mm. Guts, give it a Senpai. look. Senpai. Next time. <clears throat> Next page. It's your watch. You're our shield. I am the sword in the darkness. <clears throat> okay, I swear. I won't let you down. Now, as long as Farney stays within the f formation of her spell, and this light remains within her subconscious, no evil being of the astral world will be able to touch this ship. Uh, however, its power is halved against those of the physical world. That's when it'll be our turn to shine. Ugh. We'll handle the hand-to-hand. -hand. <laughs> We're doomed. <laughs> Now that this base, now that the base is secure, we might as well get a move on. All right, man. I sure drew the short stick guarding women and children. <laughs> Mind you, don't wind up a tentacle. <laughs> <laughs> I want to fight with that sea god thing too. A good, a good soldier knows what he's capable of and completes the job set before him. Yeah, I know. Oh, and then we have Puck as a, <laughs> yeah. as a modern soldier here. Oh my gosh. Wow. Even has a little rifle on the back. Wow. Okay, then who's talking here? The Shirka. Hmm? Oh, all right then. Draw, draw anything. <clears throat> draw anything on her. Oh wait, is that? Yeah, that's Vivalara. Oh yeah. Draw anything on her, and you two will be sleeping with the fishes. <laughs> you'll be and you'll be sleeping with the fishies. <laughs> yep. Uh... <laughs> Please take care of Casca, that boy. And my body. Yes, you can count on us. Please be careful. Cool. There's a lot of text, but it's also really small. Yeah. Bato, thank you so much for the I'm follow. Go blind. I'm sorry to ask this of you. Hmm? If possible, I'd like to oppose the foe with magic, but the odd blowing out of that cave is powerful. I fear the interior of the island is totally under the sea god's control and the spirit's powers would hardly make a difference. I'm afraid you must put yourself at risk once again. N no problem. He's tough enough to handle getting roasted or tossed around a little. 
What's the big deal? I'm counting on your help, too, Miss Good Luck Charm. Yeah, see? I, I realize that. I will not let, let you go berserk <laughs> so long as I possess you. We will return alive and well. You'll see. Rest assured. So, um, could you squat down? Oh, right. Sorry. I like this. This is exactly like something you would come up with, Jacob. Oh, yeah. You're like, the barbarian mm -hmm. uh, fighter combo. Can you please let the tiny, tiny wizard just sort of Just sort of put them in your backpack. Yeah, like. put them in your backpack so yeah. that mm -hmm. they get your speed. Right. But then also well, get, so like, a if, higher AC to, like, cover or something. Well, and so that if they go unconscious, you don't have to, like, worry yes. about carrying them. You just keep doing what you're doing. Super practical. This uh -huh. is totally something you'd come please up with. Please begin. Again. D and D or something like I'm that. I'm all too aware. Even if Guts manages to retain his consciousness, it won't lessen the burden on his body. <laughs> oh, I nice. love it. All right, next page. Damn, it's such a pain to restrain this thing. But you can summon it at the drop of a friggin' hat. Oh wait, no, <laughs> that's Guts probably. No, I'm... wait, no, no. no. You can sure summon it. it at the drop of a friggin' hat. It's like a starving beast snapping at bait. What is it? What is it this time? Is this more magic? Shirka! Okay, 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 okay catch. Ca oh, yeah, that's a Valor, yep. What happened? Her spirit came out. She's haunting guts. <laughs> How rude. Call it possession. <laughs> oh, this is cool. All right. It's like she's mounting on a like mounted like a wild like dog or a beast, dragon dragon yeah. thing. Yeah, the flow of hot is more intense than before. It's grown in power, but I will restrain it. All <laughs> right, next page. Oh, a double pager. Cool. Nice. Yep. Oh yep. my god. Oh. And now he really looks like Batman because he still has his regular eyes. He has and, like, his regular and eyes. And the jaws uncovered. You uh huh. Know? Yep. Yeah. So it's got like 98% of him, basically. Exactly. What about the other 2%? <laughs> exactly. Yes, yes. All right, next page. So that's how you put on and take off armor. It's like it's alive or something. <laughs> no, don't go near. It's dangerous. I love how <laughs> now Isma thinks that that's just how all armor works. Right, that's how armor works. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Guts, do you recognize who we are? Oh, Moradel, sorry, for the 100 bits. Thank you so much. Can we take a moment to appreciate one of the best character developments of Berserk? Farnies that at first I hate came to love her and now respect her when she finally casted her first spell. Yeah. That's true. Farnies has gone on an arc. Yeah, Shirka said friggin'. That's like, that That really threw me for a spin there because that did not sound like something Shirka would say. Yeah, not yeah at for all. sure. Oh my uh. gosh. Don't worry, I'm Batman. But, uh, that's Farney's talking up there at the top left. Yeah, no, I already, I already said, that. said that. Yep. Don't worry, I'm thinking straight. At least straight enough to know who not to bite. First off, you don't bite, you use your sword. Okay. Here we go. Don't Here we get peeled off. No need to worry. And they run on little pieces of wood. And, wow, they're, they're yep. off. That ain't human. He's like a flying fish. Are, are all knights like him? Knights? They don't even make humans like <laughs> him. Well, it's all thanks to Shirka's magic. Uh, I guess he's a transforming superhero. Oh my gosh, wow. Yes, Puck. We'd better prepare for battle, too. Mm. Mm. Stare. Stare. Moon child. Yep. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, next page. Whoa, whoa. <gasps> What's up, Isma? I hear those voices again. Voices? This it? One thing's for sure. Looks like this is on a different level than those sea hairs. This isn't like it was during the day. It's awake now. Yeah, his, his mark is bleeding crazy-like. Mm -hmm. All right, next page. The Sea God. Okay. Cool. All right. Well, if Guts can kill this thing, then maybe he can kill some of the God Hand. Okay. Because we're going to kill a sea god. god. Going to kill a sea god, y'all. Or at the <laughs> least we're going to try. Shirka. Frig. 
Guts, watch your effing mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Language, yeah. All right, next page. Sea God Part 1. New chapter. It's convenient what this does for my night vision. Still, this intimidating feeling reminds me of when we entered that Cliffoth place. If this were merely Cliffoth, I could borrow the power of the spirits of darkness who dwell there. In this domain, though, the powers of most spirits are blocked by Sea God's powerful spiritual pressure. Comedy Hudson! Yeah. Oh my god! They're going to fight Kenpachi! Triggered! Freaking Bleach! Uh, it's come full circle. Bleach uh, ripped off guts in his big sword. Uh, and now, no. Berserk comes back around and copies Bleach. Uh, <laughs> yeah, it does look like we're descending into the depths of hell. All right, next page. Whoa. Guts. Whoa, some kind of sculptures. Like a broken statue. A stone statue? It's probably a seal. It could be from an ancient culture. Or maybe, in any case, beyond this, we're going to knock on Hell's front door. Knocking Whoa. on Hell's door. Nice. All right, nice little references there. Or is that knocking on Heaven's door? Let him. Yeah. This is the Sea God's Shrine. Here they come. Tentacles. Tentacles. Here we go. <laughs> Kenpachi and Guts both have little girls on their shoulders. That's huh. that. That That's is good true. Point. And That's and good point. and and Bleach did copy a lot of things in Berserk for sure. Oh yeah. If it's a god with hit points, we can kill it. Yes, That's that right. is that is very true. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right, here we go, y'all. Oh, double pager. Check that out. Oh, that wow. Awesome. That's awesome. Oh my god. They're all just like, <laughs> Okay, but <laughs> lol, kill one of the god hand, you know. DM. Well, I gave this god full healing as a legendary action. There's no way they'll kill him in one round. And they killed him in one round. <laughs> Shirka. Bun. Kai. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> wow. Oh my gosh. Wow. wow. Here we go, y'all. <sighs> Next page. Uh, <laughs> Come into my house. Ye be most welcome here in me abode. Great. Great. No. You again. Oh, was that? Oh, was that? Sure. Yeah, that's right. I'm getting rather tired of that bony captain. You've overcome many trials and tribulations. <laughs> uh, I can't. No. I kind of feel sorry for him now. Sometimes you just can't get by if you can't laugh at yourself. To finally arrive here. Well done, brave sir. Of all Roderick's gang, you, black swordsman, there truly be only one word for your fighting style. Marvelous. It's inhuman. But too bad for you. No matter what superhuman feats you're capable of alone. Feast your eyes. We'll never run out of soldiers. There's no way for you to resist. Ah, oh, yes. Mm. And even all these brethren are not but a single part of you-know-who. Now strain your eyes, or strain those eyes, follow the faint light emitted by me brethren, and peer into the depths of this darkness. Then know that what you gaze upon be pure despair. This is Bleach. Okay, here we go. Oh my god. They're fighting god. Okura. Next page. Oh hey. look, it's Yogg-Saron. A lot of teeth. Bow down before the god of death. <laughs> freaking so is Shirka's gut stand or the other way around? Freaking sea god. Look at this thing. This is, yes, this is a big boy. This is nasty. Oh my god, there's no eyes even. It's just teeth and tentacles. Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Next page. Oh, and it continues another double pager, but it's a half double pager. But wow. But I'm Batman. And naturally, the sea god took it right personally that his beloved whiskers were lopped off. Too bad, eh? That you, what you were so fighting, what you were fighting so desperately, were nothing more than his whiskers, bored up through the island. More is the pity. <gasps> okay, here we go. 
Ooh. Ooh. It just opens its mouth and just sound effects text. All right. Just that, that's covering cool. over the whole that's thing. That's cool. Just, what's, what's the sound effect? Where is it? I'm going to see if I can find it. Oh, here it is. What spiritual pressure. Ah, she said it again. <laughs> she said it again, Jacob. Ah. ah. Is this a Bleach movie? <laughs> it's going to turn into goop, too, all of a sudden. I never expected this much. How do you fight something so gigantic? It's just too big for me to handle. All right, next page. Yo ho ho, you're like a shrimp about to be fed to an octopus. You're about to be eaten shell and all. Now, chow down, brethren. Ha <laughs> ha. He said chow down. Yep. Just, mm -hmm. just said, what is this? Walk along. Yeah. Oh my gosh. You can't fight this many at once. Let's fall back into the narrower part of the cave so you can take them on one at a... No, bottlenecks make it too hard for me to maneuver. Besides, I can't whittle away all my strength here at the front door. But there's no way. We're, go We're going to straight up fight all these things? We're headed one way and one way only. Oh, he's basically saying, ignore them. Let's just go straight for the big D, yeah. the big boy. Uh, Wait. Squidding, kill him. <laughs> All, All right, right next yeah. page. We're leaping right into that big mouth. <gasps> Leap into its mouth? I mean, hey, you got to yeah. go to the center of this thing and find some organs. Exactly. Like, this is not going to be a fight carried by outside it we're going straight inside this thing mm -hmm. oh my god here he goes he jumps right. and we're off we're off to the races <laughs> meanie the the scurvy dog's jumping around are you hanging us out to dry gow oh he can <laughs> kick them right in the face <laughs> gow <laughs> wow next page and with that he kicks off and, and he's jumps. still flying above all the tentacle monsters and stuff. Yep. Wow. He's he's basically Batman. This is amazing. Pretty much. This Pretty is much. amazing. All he needs is for his cape to turn into wings. Like that. Yep. That would be the the final the final straw. Oh, that was the end of a chapter. Wow. Yeah. So now we go to Sea God Part Two. Okay. I like how more and more actually Guts' his hair is being shown prominently. Oh yeah. Meaning mm -hmm. that on some level maybe he's getting more control. Of the Berserker armor via uh, uh, sure, because it's not here. just like the job, it's uncovered, it's like his basically his whole face, yeah, basically his whole face and you know, some mm -hmm. of his head with his hair, yeah. Oh, and we're going straight into the mouth, yep, yep, yep. Oh, no, he's just hopping over, yeah, these just, things. just getting onto them, slicing hup, and hup, jumping. Hup, hup, yep. hup. All right, you take 25 attacks of opportunity. Oh, uh, I have okay, cool. Just realize I have an AC of thirty-four. Yeah, exactly. And we're not playing Pathfinder. This is fifth edition. <laughs> Round right. of accuracy. Right, exactly. <laughs> All right, next page, and yep, yep. Eek. Just hop, 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 hop. <laughs> Don't get pulled off. I'm a spirit. I can't be you, idiot. <laughs> what are you doing? He's not a beanbag. There be hundreds of you. Can't one of you manage to catch him? Did and hut, 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 hut. Were beanbags just canonized in the Berserk world? I have no idea. Out of the way. I'm trying to jump right into that freakishly huge maw. Mm, the All toothy right. maw. Yep, yep. Yes. And here he's go. He's going okay. straight for it. Yep. Straight for it. All right. I mean, he's guess, she guess going to just trust Shirka to be able to, to, to see. Oh Something my like gosh. That. Yeah. All right, tentacles, tentacles. Here we go. And one final jump. What, and then it bites down? Ah. Yeah. He's goddamn insane. Ah, what an idiot. He let himself get eaten. That's like a little fish jumping into a whale's mouth. What good does he think that's gonna do? He'll be shit by tomorrow morn. Ah, that takes care of the most bothersome of the bunch. Now we be free to feast away on that damned annoying stallion and his cohort's brethren. It's the climax of the festival. Let's be on our way. Oh, uh, cool. I love how this pirate is basically an evil speedwagon of the sea god. Basically, basically yeah. Uh huh. 
He's <laughs> like, yeah, yeah. Tactical vor. Right? Ugh. All right, and then all the blob tentacle monsters are on their way towards... Uh, uh, yep. And with the ship, that's right. right. So we're going to have a ship battle yeah. with one ship that's had a huge spell cast around it right, for protection. And then another one that's coming with undead tentacle monster zombie pirates yeah. and stuff. Wow. All right. That's Berserk for you. Oh, okay. Next page. So the inside. Oh, and <laughs> he just got throat vomited. Whoa. Out. Oh, and its stomach is full of ships. Of course. Looks like we made it in. That was crazy. It even glows a little inside this damn thing. I guess there are squids like that. Oh. Well, I guess there are squids like that, you know? <laughs> yeah. They think it has some connection to the physical right. world in some way. Uh-huh. All right, next page. It's like some legendary ship graveyard. They must have been dragged in by those tentacles. Tentacles, damn them. The sea god takes in its victims and makes them part of itself. It's so repulsive. So what plan to do now? What do you plan to do now? Look how huge its stomach is. Inflicting a small wound in here would only feel like being stuck up by a little fish bone. Don't you hear it? A cannon? Is the seahorse bombarding it? No. That's a pulse. It's the sound of the sea god's heart. That's a pulse? Well... Actually, I suppose it... Oh, well, that is, well that's... actually, I suppose it is. Doesn't matter how big its body is. When it comes down to it, this thing's nothing more than an octopus. Even a bone means trouble if it sticks you in the heart. So this is Slay the Spire. This cool. is, yeah, yeah. We are we are literally going to go Slay mm -hmm. the Heart. Like, yep. Guts is basically doing the, it has hit points, so right. it can die. Yeah. If we give it enough critical hits. Yep. All right. But with the sound echoing all over the place, I'm not sure where its heart is. Oh, <clears throat> oh! but with the sound echoing all over the place, I'm not sure where the heart is. Can you tell, Shirka? Leave it to me. If I follow the flow of Odd through its body... Uh, we could be stuck in here for years. <laughs> <laughs> there. Above and to the right is where its blood flow gathers. We'd better hurry. Those tentacles out there aren't about to ignore the seahorse. Now, we could scale the wall, the stomach wall, or cut through it and push, push through the entrails, but both ways would take too long. Guts! And... Wait, what? Stomach acid being dumped out. Oh. Like little, little sections there. Yeah. There's... Oh, that's, that's Shirka at the top there. There's so much of it. Uh, we need to hurry and get out of here. This works out well. Huh? We'll let it carry us to the top. You're being reckless again. Nah, all I have to do is get to the top without dissolving. Oh, sure. Oh, and there's little things in there. Ew. Oh, little, little microbial but guts, nasty. Its, whole, its stomach isn't going to fill up completely with acid. Like, right. that would make it want to vomit. All right, next page. Oh, oh, little, little... Potato bugs. Little potato bug tentacly little things. In their schmaw. Yeah. Their schmaw. Actually, these are like those things we fought in, um... These are like those Void Woken we fought in Divinity. Remember? Oh, yeah, yeah. Look very similar. What are those? Oh, that's me. Sorry. What are those? I don't know. Uh, probably parasites that live inside the sea cot or something. They must be climbing to escape the stomach acid. <laughs> oh, they just jumped. They yeah. just jumped. No! No, 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 no. I'm not about that. And he lifts up his sword, and the fighting begins. We cut outside to the sea. Multiple vessels to starboard! It's the pirate ship, and a swarm of monsters! Yes, we can! <laughs> what? Okay. Okay. <laughs> Captain, there's a fleet's worth of them. We should fall back for now. No need to be scared. We can take them. We stand prepared to meet them. Wow. Wait. <coughs> yeah, there were that many swarming things right under my feet? Lady Farnese. Or Lady Farnese, it is dangerous here. You should go down into the hold. I must remain here to make sure that formation of the four holds. Guard her well, sir. Serp, yeah. Serp. 
Yeah, yeah. And you gotta guard Shirka well. Yes. All right, battle has begun. All right. No, our seahorse has a goddess in command of angels on board. <laughs> Fire! Oh, wait, 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 wait no, 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 in a big, in a big ship? Oh yeah, no, I know, but they've been like ninety six. Oh sure, like sure. like I I I think they're, they're not not cannons, but like ammunition. Like I wonder if that would end up being a thing where because they haven't like restocked or something, they'd end up like stupid, running out stupid amounts because they don't actually fire that many per cannon. Right. Each cannon usually fires like twice or maybe maybe three times. Mm -hmm. I think it's I think if I remember correctly. I think it was what, like twenty to like thirty seconds to reload. Mm -hmm. Help me out here, chat. I I don't remember reading up on this kind of history stuff, but like, is that is that about about how much time it was? Well, but, but I'm yeah. just thinking like you know, the the amount of like ammunition total on the ship. Yeah, it's not going to be relevant to make a huge difference in the battle for sure. But uh, yeah. Pay it no mind. Full speed ahead, me hearties. And right. here they go. Oh, blowing God. them away. But right, like, I want to see what the spell does to them when they, when, oh, when they sure. get close. Yeah. But like they haven't restocked on anything since they left. So Wait, what's... Uh, oh, that's the smoke from the, the yeah, cannons yeah, from the firing. Cannons. Okay, well, here's the spell. Here's the spell. Oh, and we would cut away to another chapter. That, yep, right. That... Wow, oh, so Oh no, here we go. I know, I know, but I'm saying that's mm -hmm. that's what people had to wait on basically. Right, right. Sea God mm -hmm. part three. Oh they burst into flames. They stopped. Yeah, and they're burning. Yeah, a lot of them are burning. Look, they've stopped! They can't get inside this wall of light. Well, I'll be damned. It stopped that many monsters. Not bad, Farney. You are a goddess. Oh wait. You are a goddess. I think that might be. Well, naturally, after all that training with Shirka every day. That's Sivalara mm -hmm. still. You're the seahorse's guardian angel. Or maybe it's not. Not me. It might be someone else, but yeah. All right. With as many of them, we could hit them with our eyes closed. Keep firing and at will. Oh. And penetration oh. damage, too. Because if they're stopped right outside, it's going to hit them at close range. That's right. Oh yeah, so double pager though. Double pager. Look double at Double pager, double penetration. D I mean, that's like not more than double. We're yeah, getting no, into like infinite Quadruple. infinite penetration works. <laughs> oh my. God. Unlimited penetration works. Oh boy. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh, damage over time. Oh. <laughs> no, splash damage and splash damage. enemies. <laughs> yes. <laughs> AoE Splash damage. Yeah, it's like oh. it's it's like when the when the the wizard is basically like cannon beads. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. Yes. All right. Next. Like next shooting page. ballistic gelatin from close up. Wow. Uh. All right. Oh, nice. Okay, so I take back what I said. The the cannonballs are going to make a huge difference in the battle. Nice. Got him. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> That's the way. Blow any of them that get close to pieces. You good for nothing buffoons. <laughs> they rolled right over their own guys. Oh. No, they the didn't ship. roll a Cidro. This is a boat. It doesn't use wheels. Yeah, because the ship is, uh, is a physical object, remember? It's only uh -huh. going to be half as effective. Yeah. All right, next page here. Oh. Oh. Some some shark bone, or is that just the head of the ship? I think it's the head of the ship, but it's different. Yeah. Shh. The pirate ship's bow got through the light. What's going on? This formation is a spell to defend against those who are not of this world. It's only half as effective against anything with physical substance. And the reason why they're mm. repeating it is because yep. there were uh -huh. literal like maybe months or maybe even a year between that chapter where they explained this. And well, they didn't. Uh, I mean, think about it. Uh, 
You wonder if Mira right. basically said this although, again. Although Shirka repeated it just like, you know, like a few chapters ago. That's my oh, point. Oh, oh, right. Is yeah, that a few yeah. chapters ago yes. might have been a year ago. <laughs> right. That's a good point. Yeah. That's, that's why they that's why they're repeating it. Yeah. All right. Oh, and the ship's cracking a bit. Rocking and rolling. Okay. Yo ho ho ho. <laughs> I love this pirate. All right. Now we can finally get down to some swashbuckling. <laughs> Boss man, my body's kind of numb. I don't feel anything below <laughs> the waist. Just pretend you are sting you are stung by a stingray or something. <laughs> <laughs> These pirates. Now then, gents, time for you to pay back in full the debt you owe. Then after we slice you up and eat your fill, we'll let bygones be bygones, and it'll be a tentacle slice for us. Well, we will all be true brethren of the... Hey, huh? Ah! What's tentacles life? <laughs> What's tentacles life, you octopus? Make that sucker. <laughs> Who in their right mind would ever want to become one of you nasty-ass tentacles? <laughs> you want to be a squid on a stick? Oh my wow. god. <laughs> and you stink like squid. You ain't brethren of the sea or nothing anymore. You're just fruit of the sea. <laughs> okay. This is all this right. Is, this is amazing. Uh, this is, I love this how Isidro is, is the one standing at the front and like, you know, talking and everything. Being a badass here. You betcha. Fruit. <laughs> Serpico's like fruit. We've also got vinegared squid. Oh my gosh, Puck. Puck has. A squid on his arm, a little mini squid. Yep. And then he's got some kind of like kebabbed snake. Thing. I think that's I think that's the squid on a stick. So oh, he's, so nice. he's got the 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 regular you know or the vinegared squid and then the squid that's on a stick. Oh my gosh! Wow. You want to do as on? Oh yeah. I'm nearly convinced myself I was a mariner too. I nearly convinced myself I was a mariner too. <laughs> when did you put that on? It's time for a thrashing. All right, let's go. What do you know? Do what do you dogs know about a tentacle's feelings? <laughs> what? What is this? What is this manga? <laughs> Can it, you slimy creep? Ah! Wow. <coughs> that pirate voice, though, does the numbers on my throat. I can imagine. Ugh. Okay, and... And meanwhile, guts. on another ship. Yep. <laughs> There's no end to them. We've nowhere else to run. Where's the ceiling? It's still a bit out of reach. Yeah. The mast. These things are weighing it down. It's collapsing. Hey, Guts, you wouldn't. <sighs> and he leaps up okay. the mast. And looks like he's going to pierce his sword into the top. Probably. So that he can, like, climb, I guess? But he's doing more of a slicing motion. Yeah, he's doing a so... slice motion, yeah. So, I don't know. Maybe he's just going to open it up. All right. Maybe. Uh, he swung. What did he do? So he, he Slashed. Cuts. Yeah. And eventually it, it catches in inside? Yep, yep. Okay, so it's caught inside. He's swinging his legs up. But it's starting using... to slide out. Yep, yep. Okay. So then the sword slides out. He gotcha. goes up. That should do it. So and... he falls. And yeah, they're... And they're falling. We're okay. falling. Wait. So, and then stuff rushes through the hole? Or... Gotcha. Or or does like blood or water or stuff come out of the hole? I, guess we'll I, see. I don't know. We'll see. All right, next page. Oh. What what happened? The stomach acid has pressurized all the gas in there, and it went gushing out like a burp. Oh! I didn't know how thick the stomach wall was. Whether I could cut through it or not was a gamble. But it paid off. Please stop being so reckless. You're not likely to listen, but you're giving me an ulcer too. Sorry about that. Looks like we're just getting started, though. Wait, what? So now they're on the outside of the stomach. What? What is this? What? Wait. wait. 
Yo! Wait, can I see? What the heck are those things? So, they're not spiders. They're not spiders. They're like ten-legged ants. Yeah, but with like daddy, really long legs. But like daddy long legs is. Oh wait, no, no, they are spiders, Caleb. Sorry. No, no. So, so they have eight of the big legs, and then they have like appendages on no! the body portion. No. Ah. 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 So far, it's fine, but oh. Uh. They look actually kind of stupid because of the legs. Uh huh. Well, yeah, they're like daddy long legs. Is, you know. Looks like this thing's insides are a den of monsters. They eliminate foreign enemies in exchange for nourishment from the sea god. <laughs> they complement each other. Well, too bad. We not we might not be permanent residents, but our den's at stake too. Time to force our way through. Okay. And they keep cutting back. Nice, nice, cool. So basically, like. Prepping for the anime version of Spider -Man, this. Spider Man, Spider Man does whatever a spider can. Yep. Fight, fight, fight your way through, or else every last one of you is shark bait. Don't let them win! We'll take the high road while they're busy with you. Yo ho ho, this be why tentacles rule. <sighs> and Serpico. <laughs> the last airbender. <laughs> That's right. Uh, nanny. <laughs> oh, wow. You can use magic too, Wind Charm Guy? <laughs> Wind Charm Guy? <laughs> wait, wait, wait a minute. What is that? What is that little look, though? The little. Oh, it's a wind it's charm. It's a wind charm. I yeah. got it. Yeah. <laughs> hey, ho! Next page. That's incredible, Stowaway. Oh, Buckethead. Wrong! I am the Black Mustached Knight. Remember that! Nice. Incoming! For this! Tentacles. My snake saved the day. <laughs> nice. What are you doing? You usually fight harder than this. Easy for you to say. It's hard to move when your lower half's numb. Just pretend you got stuck by a cone snail or something. And make up for it with spirit. <laughs> oh, and a Sidro. Oh, Sidro, coming Is he in. He going clutch. after the captain. He's going in, yeah. dual wielding. Uh huh. Dual wielding like a badass. Go, okay. Sidro. Next page. Uh, booming art. All right. Booming art will of Boy, course be amazing. Time to knock you into the sea again. <laughs> I love how Isidro's like, I've got, I really thought about this one-liner, but now that I say it, it still yep. sounds stupid. Just I've been die! I've before, I'll do it again. Exactly. <laughs> Their fight continues. You, you've sharpened your skills. I'm a growing boy, and I've had plenty of training. Look at Puck, like, barely holding wow. on when he swings his head around there. <sighs> on a rocking boat, thanks very much. Whoa, close call. As you say, but as for strength itself, you still don't. Wait. And he sees the basket. So then he... Wait, what? He jumps. Oh, he takes his sword, stabs oh, it into the basket. He, yeah, he threw, throws the basket onto his head. Whips it onto his head. And then brings his fire dagger down on the basket. Right, because he can't see yeah. when the basket's on there. Eeeh! The little brat. He's quick to use anything he can get his hands on. Not even grown men used to combat can do that very often. He pisses me off so much. Oh. By the powers, you're one fiend of a lad. You are cut out for pirating with your talents. Well, you still, sh you still sure I can't interest you in a new job? No way. You guys are filthy, stupid, and above all, you're already seafood. This is true. All right, then. That really is too bad. And <gasps> Crossbow. But, oh well, adults have many duties. One of them is nipping young shrimps in the bud. And... <laughs> what? And... 
So he just barely ducked underneath oh. it. Oh, I hit him. I did it, Isidro. Oh my gosh, Isma, awesome. Okay. Nice one, Isma. But this is dangerous, so stand back. What is, what is, what is, a punk, punk gave a thumbs up. Look at punk giving the thumbs nice. up. Oh my gosh. Nice. Wow. Oh, is this his third fight? This is this, is this Isidro's third fight with, with him? With the pirate captain, I think, yeah. Oh my gosh, wow. <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh. <clears throat> I'd be a dead now if it wasn't a, if I wasn't a tentacle. Oh, boss man! They're forcing us back! Fight them off! We can't keep this up any longer! You lily livered lot! You're pathetic! Oh wait, yeah. Yar! <laughs> yes, yar! <laughs> oh my gosh. Yes, best puck just. Mm -hmm. Time to go for broke. Wait, no, I don't want to die. <sighs> Show them what tentacles are made of. I, I don't want to fry. fry. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're risking their lives. Yeah. Toe. <laughs> I said stand back. Isma. Nice pitch. <laughs> wait, wait. So she throws. Uh, What is she throwing? Just random stuff? No. It's it's something something specific. I guess we'll find out in a second. This is dangerous! Uh, and then she's saying, I'm ready with a harpoon! Huh? Those things? A bunch fell on the deck. And... Wait a minute. What are they? Um... Are they... Bombs, things of gunpowder. Alcohol? Alcohol, I, yeah. Mm. I don't know. We'll find out, I guess. Our tentacles are totally different oh, from the rest. Powder. They're immense potent. They're immense potent. No membrane can stand up to them. They're just itching to burst as we speak. <laughs> and then he's catching up. Boom! Fire. It burst! <laughs> ah! Get back here! We had enough of this. We don't want to die twice. If it's that important to you, do it yourself, boss man. I, I hit what? Hey, what? You dogs! Yo ho ho! Until we meet again, gentlemen. Wow. Never come back. Go wrap yourself around some sperm whale. <laughs> oh my gosh! You kicked ass, Isma. Nah, it was no big deal. You are cool, too! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we got through that. We got... Oh, wait, no, that's you. We got through that somehow. Yeah, somehow. A ghost ship and the monster swarm. This feels like some kind of legendary voyage now. We have to thank... We have you to thank, Farnese. You're the reason we're still alive. And everyone just cheered, Farnese! The, the seahorse's sea guardian angel! Farnese, the goddess of victory! Keep down the noise, you'll mess up Sherka's spell. Ooh. <laughs> Even Casca just, ooh. Uh. Oh, wait, uh, that, that, that's probably, uh, yeah. Praise is well and good, you but keep it civil. This way. Thanks. Eat sailors need to treat ladies with dignity at all times. Ah! Now, the rest depends on Guts and Shirka. Is it over? Oh my gosh, where was he this whole time? He was in a, in barrel. a barrel! He wow. was in barrel a barrel! Boy. Oh, oh, poor guy! Wow. He was in a barrel this whole time. Wow. Gotcha, uh, they were gunpowder bags, okay. <laughs> Someone's saying, I wish I had some tentacles to burst my membrane. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, okay, so these these bug things aren't that freaky. They they kind of look so nondescript and ridiculous that you know it's okay. Right, guts. This is a lot louder than the seahorse's cannons. My gut. No, my whole damn body feels numb. Yeah, this is a big heart. Next Whoa. Page. Oh. It's actually a lot smaller than I thought. Oh. You can bet if I stayed here too long, the pulse alone would kill me with madness. Well, hurry before it happens. I know. Guts? But my body's... Uh, the air's heavy and stagnant. I can breathe. 
but my body's heavy. It's like I'm underwater. No wonder the sound carries so well. The pulse suddenly grew more intense. What the? Um. Oh. oh. Moonchild can can tell something's up. Mm -hmm. Oh, what's with him? Bro, oh, something's going on on the island. Hey, climbing up there is dangerous, son. Ugh. Uh, what's wrong, Isma? I don't know. I just felt this terrible chill. I'm, I'm scared. Come on, get down. Mm hmm. Oh, it's moving. Wait. Oh. I'll bet you anything it's leaving the island. The reason why the pulse got more intense is because it's probably now like, oh, I can now tell that they're... Maybe. Oh, crap. Here we go. Next page. Oh, yep. I think I was right. I think oh, I was right. Eyes on the heart. Awesome. Oh, God. The heart is like a behelet in some ways then. Sure. Something. Dang. This, this sequence of of panels this is so crazy so now yep. the island's falling apart yep. yep it's leaving uh -huh. yep oh my god oh my okay. sea god <laughs> oh, 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 oh oh crap all right all right next page oh yep here it comes wow it's bursting its way out of the island Okay, scale, y'all. Scale. Mm -hmm. Berserk is all about it now. Yes. Look oh, at that definitely. thing. That just looks like a ball at this yeah, point. Yeah, like but... a, big, a big wrecking ball. Oh, my God. All right, yes. next page. Double pager. There's oh. still so many. <laughs> it's a sea god, all right. This feels like the ocean floor. Wow. Oh, gross. Okay. Ew. Okay. Shark tentacles, eels, and whatever these things All are. All kinds of crap. Yep. All right, next page. Oh, new chapter. A call from the deep. <laughs> In the pirate ship. Yo ho ho! Shiver me timbers! Our sea god be a sight to behold. Now the stallions, Ilkar, are. are. Oh! Assuming direct control. Yeah. They all just got. They mm -hmm. all just got completely dominated by it. Okay. Wow. We will miss you, pirate buddy. I mean, not really. Not really, but... Not really. Not but, really, but... but yeah. <laughs> you were oh, silly and, and The seahorse is massive, yes. That's a good point. Wow. Yeah. All right, next page here. Whoa. <laughs> oh, my God. One of the tentacles pierced the bottom of the ship. Mm-hmm from underneath the wave and just lifted it up like it was nothing yep oh my god all right cool. this is crazy <laughs> all right next page here that must be the root of all those tentacles whoa whoa there's there's huge and then there's ridiculous <laughs> the sea god it's like your legend said isma that thing could swallow all the fish and ships around here whole. The island, my island, my home, it's sinking. Huh. Whoa, here it comes. Wow, and it's Teeth just- Teeth opening up and it's, it's just- It's just gonna swallow them? I mean, it, they gotta leave now. <laughs> all hands cling to something, here comes a giant wave! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, uh, boy. A whole bunch of water was just displaced. Oh, boy. Next page. Whoa! Double pager! Okay. Oh, this is good. This I'm is so good. Oh, do you remember that part in the King Kong movie? Do you remember that part in the King Kong movie? The Peter Jackson one. When they're in the, the canyon? The big worms. The big worms that attack them. Right, in the canyon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 This reminds me of that. Sure. Any of you that saw that King Kong movie, that part genuinely on, gave like, the guy's head yeah, and that part genuinely gave me like oh. nightmares oh yeah like, that, that was terrifying that part like yep. oh that was so disgusting yes the <laughs> bug pit yes yeah oh oh my gosh the biggest nope ever <laughs> yeah for yeah. real uh-huh oh my gosh yeah and one of them eats andy circus right. that's right yep, yep just bites his head off oh my gosh all right next page oh 
But oh. hey, they have hit points. You can almost like hear the blood like coming Just out of that. The way they go. Uh -huh. oh. Yeah. Oh, casual got so stabbing good. worm dicks on the heart of a sea god, wondering where his life went wrong. Right, right. Uh, yeah. What am I doing? What are any of us doing? <laughs> where was I? Oh yeah, the meaning of life by guts. Okay, all right, all right. Battle continues. Yep. If this god thing's on the move, we don't have any time to waste. Yep. All right, all right. Well, we're doing so far so good. Guts' mm -hmm. is, Guts is movements with this would just be crazy to see animated. Oh, yeah. Oh, and all the eyes on the heart looking at you. And they're sending their wave of madness at him. Okay. Oh, and now all the things surround him and converge. Oh, and they, they actually did surround him. Crap. Wait. Yeah, look. See, he was here. And then all of them just, just oh, crashed wow. on him. You can almost see the cape being torn. Oh, all right. Next page. Cutting back to the ship. Seahorse is... Uh, wave hits it. Is surviving the wave oh. somewhat? Oh, Isidro gets oh, washed Isidro's overboard. Oh, washed overboard. And that's uh, you. Isidro! Oh, no. Hmm. Oh. Oh, good. Isma's jumping Just in to save in him. after him. Wait. Don't be crazy. Because she's a, she's a marrow. Right. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Oh, cool. Okay. Oh, she's in the water. She's grabbed him. He's, like, trying to hold his oh. breath. Whoa, and now here come all the tentacles and everything. Oh, my God. They're, they're catching up. Whoa. This shot with the shadows mm -hmm. of them. Yep. Oh. oh, this Th voice. This voice. Whoa. Next page. Speak. Speak. Chant, say it, say the name, the name given you, that you know not, your one and only true name. Name? My true name? Name? Whoa, dang. Next page. Whoa. Whoa. That's a double cool. pager. Oh my god. So this is her this transformation. Is her form, yeah. As a, as a marrow. Into a marrow, yeah. Wow. Oh, that's awesome. Man, Isidro. Double pager. Wow. Okay. All right. All right. Here we go. And... Yeah, Sidro freaks out. <laughs> and she's swimming fast now. Yep. Mm -hmm. She's swimming fast. All, All right. right. Okay. Here we go, buddy. To the surface. Marrow part one. All nice. right. And then... Did you get into the air? Someone just say Isidro's getting some tail. Wow. Wow. <laughs> and they crest above the water. And he's just... <laughs> the moon behind them there. All right, next page. And, and then flops onto, the, onto boat. the boat surface. Cool. Yep. She almost kind of crushes Isidro, though. What like, now? <laughs> it's a Zon. What's this? That's a. Uh... And that's her. Hey, uh, Isidro! That was sure was close. Wait. Isma, did you just. Whoa, fish! <laughs> <laughs> fish, yes, yes. That, Indeed. That is. That, yes. It do be like that sometimes. Uh -huh. Yep, yep. Alright, next page. <laughs> fish lips? <laughs> hey, well, I swim as well as a fish. What gives? You're the one gaping like a fish. Tits? Whatever. They're no big deal. Oh my god. Wait. No, no. Not tits. No, not tits. Tail. Tail. <laughs> oh. And then. Fish! That's her. Oh, it's her. Fish! <laughs> what, what, what the hell is this? A, a tail. A fish tail. Why? Did I eat too many fish? No. Is there a fish biting my butt? This thing, it's, it's real. Calm down. <laughs> wow, you're calm already. No. no. Oh, I think I learned a trick. The stuff my pa told me, it, it was true. Marrow. She's a marrow. The girl's a marrow, huh? Yeah. You guys got some problem with that? <laughs> <laughs> No standing around. Get those sh get those cannons ready to fire again. 
Well, well what? why not at this point? <laughs> eh? We've already seen a ghost ship and a bunch of monsters. <laughs> Besides, this is no time for that. That thing out there is what we need to worry about. But why? All of a sudden... This'll make... Oh my god. <laughs> This'll make money. You've been in the ocean before, but you've never changed, right? I heard voices. Oh, she's doing a nya ha 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 laugh. Yeah. Wow. They always whispered to me in the sea, but this time they were loud and clear. They said to chant a name I'd never heard. My true name, when I did what they said. Your true name? Um, I think it's... Hey, stop that! Don't say it! Oh my god. <laughs> if Alara knows what's yeah. up. <laughs> Listen! Elves, spirits, and whatnot have a secret name they can never, never tell anyone. That's your true name. Your true name governs your true form. You went back to this form because you chanted it. And if somebody finds out your true name, it means he'll have control over you. So never tell anyone unless it's someone you can really trust. And Puck is like, huh, you don't say. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's how it works. But hey, I, I wouldn't really mind if you guys knew it. Oh, no. Oh, no, you can't trust that. <laughs> Have you got a true name too? Uh, Justin Bailey. No, Apa Don Don Lafrit. I forget now. <laughs> wow. Pod calling himself wow. Justin Bailey. Wait, what? <laughs> Justin Bailey? Who is that even? Like, oh my gosh. Manny Fico trying to hear the name. Oh my gosh. Look at uh -huh. Manny Fico in the top left. Wow. Yeah. That sounds strange, though. Who could you? Who could tell you your secret name if you didn't even know a, know it yourself? That's what I'd like to. Ow! Oh, the the uh -huh. the, the kids yeah. biting the tail. But she's doing the little yeah. ho ho Like, <laughs> hey, look at that! All right, next page. Whoa! Oh, it was others. Gotcha. There's a school of something gathering around the island. Are they dolphins? Look how many there are. They're beneath the ship, too. Those are... Marrows! Marrowems! Marrowems, ha 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 ha. Le nice, Le nice. <laughs> All right, My next, people. Next page. Meanwhile... <laughs> meanwhile, crunching intensifies. Mm -hmm. Cuts! <laughs> yep. And going for the, going for the big one. Ooh, yes. we have a big catfish here. Mm. Mm. Are you all right? Yeah, your mistress's heirloom is really something. They won't bite through it like some crab or lobster shell. And as you know, it doesn't hurt. Not even as much as getting stuck by a little bone. And he jumps, and the heart blasts with some kind of psychic energy. Right. And these things are going for him. And he slices. And he slices into the heart. Here we go. Or is that the heart or the things that are coming after him? I think it's both, but, but I, think I think he's the catfish. On, I think he's on the heart. Oh, you think it's the catfish? Okay. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, I see the teeth. Yeah, you're you're right. Yep, 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 yep. You're right. That that whole yeah. thing there. It's just the cape and the blood and everything swirls around it. Yeah. <sighs> <sighs> Oh, his body's just breaking now. Yeah. Cuts! Pushing through his limits! Yep, yep, next page. And this is to go even further beyond! And we keep cutting away from it! As uh -huh. we're about to make progress! Marrow! It's a big school of marrow! Oh, they're making for that monster! Oh. What do they plan to do? Are they in league with that thing? Of, <laughs> of course not, stupid! Listen, I'll tell you about Marrow. Hey, Isma. It was all true. The legend and what my pa told me. I'm going to. Isma! Okay. This is my island, and Marrow fight against the sea god. There she goes. Hey, Captain! You just gonna stand there and watch? This is no pleasure cruise, right? If we don't pick up the pace, we'll miss all the action. Fine, just calm down. Get us in range of that monster. Don't worry about its tentacles. Don't worry about its tentacles. Just be mindful of the surge. And we go to fight a sea god. All right. Wow. Cool. Dang. This was a 
much slower paced, I would say, uh, volume just in general because we're really going into getting, you know, this sea monsters kind of thing set up here. Oh, Geyser TV with the 100 bits. Justin Bailey was the password you put in the original Metroid on the NES to unlock Zero Suit Samus. Wow. Oh, okay, gotcha. Gotcha. Wait, Sea Monster Puck? Where? Where? I gotta see this. Oh, yes, yes, there he is. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. And he's he's doing a little, like, yeah, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Volume 40 doesn't release until October. Right, that's right. Okay. Yeah, it's not, not for a while, yeah. Casually biting the captain's head. Wait, was he biting it, or was he, like, making, like, a making like a face at him oh wow he's been he's been he's been doing that for a while like here he is there and it's somewhere right around here he switched right there he's like yeah Bleh. but then is he biting the captain's head oh yeah right here that's why that's why he's looking up <laughs> right there he's just like right puck what are you doing <laughs> come on man why are you gonna be like this puck much slower paced volume this volume cast literally battles of god right right yeah right but but the idea of them battling this it's a thing... slow multi-staged combat what can we say and right. there was a lot of the pirate like there was a lot of the pirate too yeah i'm I think... glad that the pirate's gone as fun as he was i'm glad he's gone yeah i think it's more like he provided kind of a a, a silly kind of fun nature to this whole thing mm -hmm. because battling against old god thing just sounds kind of dark and heavy and he's sure. yes. he's yes. basically he was the levity yes he's the levity of the madness that <laughs> and yeah. well volume 34 had two gods fighting each other that's true yeah it, it just feels a little impersonal as well like like this is obviously something that's crazy cool and cool like great spectacle and right stuff. but like why are they fighting this yeah, why why did this island little mini Because they decided be the cuz they place? decided to go to the random island that the DM was like, "Hey, here's an island where you can re you know, like right. replenish, you know, stuff." Right. I just feel like given the given this given the self-contained nature of the character of um yeah, side of quest Isma, that this is basically a side mini arc three episode hey, thing in a TV show. Isidro has to build his harem. You know, Isidro has to build his harem. You yeah, say, yeah, like because he he had now that the literal harem, you know, that gave the, that offer to Isidro is right. out of the story. Right, he needs to build up an anime harem. You gotcha, know? gotcha. So, yeah, so this is his C Neko, you know, portion. Exactly, you know, just the, just uh, all of the marrow there. will be like, ah, you have returned our lost child to us. We will repay you in sexual favors yeah. from all of us. You, you know? can say it's like. He needs to suck the marrow out of life, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Hopefully yeah. the marrow don't suck the life out of him. Do you think Griffith has a true name? Um, if Maybe. so, do you think it has any effect on him, effect to him or influence over his control of the humans in his kingdom? No, I don't think so. Well, actually, no, that's a good point. Because marrow and, like, sea creatures and stuff, that's closely related to, like, like singing under the sea, right? You know? Oh, okay. So... And so I think that could be the way that they end up defeating Griffith is they find out his true name. And if we want to figure that out, then we need to go to... Are you being serious right now? We need to go yeah, to the Berserk. Yeah, you, yeah. I can tell when you're not being serious. Where, you know, Griffith singing, you know, uh, you know, someday I'll be part of your world. The Passion with the 100 bits. Bonebeard was Kaborowitz 2.0. Exactly. Yes, yes yep. absolutely. Mm -hmm. Right. But I just, I just feel like this was something that they put in there to slow down the overall story because they're headed to Elfhelm, mm -hmm. and they, you know, Mira hadn't maybe fully finished writing what Elfhelm would be like and mm -hmm. all that. So yeah, just imagine it being like a Witcher Three side quest, Caleb. Yeah, yeah, I definitely think there is that, but I feel like even then, the main things that are compelling about a Witcher Three side quest are the characters in it, right? Less so the combat. Yeah, exactly. The, the the characters in Berserk are very compelling. The art of Berserk is very compelling. Yes. The combat is less compelling. When it involves guts, it's still awesome. And well, the combat is still like amazingly drawn and everything. Yes. But the this this shows showcases that Berserk did come out a long time ago. And even though this might have been more recent, that storytelling 
nature of like the ah uh, we'll come up with a new baddie for them to fight you know mm-hmm. um it just felt more impactful when we had zod exactly, skull knight yep. you know big mm-hmm. people that actually like are what i would you know that that have consequences that can be done mm-hmm. to them that are permanent you know yeah you think about you think about guts and what can happen to him right now and he's basically invincible like it's it's almost a thing of where I'm never really worried about well, guts. Right. What I'm what I'm interested I'm more worried in about seeing, his party. Right. His party, and then also seeing the yeah. consequences of the berserker armor. Right. Yes. Because that will continue to take a toll. At That's this point, true. like the combat is basically just an excuse for the berserker armor, and then yeah. also something to throw in there because that was such a, a crucial part of the manga leading up to now. But right now, I feel like Miro would be just as happy having this be completely slice of life. <laughs> nice one, yeah. Who cares about writing new plots when you've got some Idol Master to play through? <laughs> oh, yeah, let me put up these uh, these Imgur photos here. Oh, cool one of the, nice. of the seahorse and the old god. Oh, and then the tentacles attacking the, uh, the crewmates. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, that's terrifying. Oh, yeah, and then you mm-hmm. have... Uh, you have Isma in the marrow form. I, I thought Aww. for sure she was going to have to do something where it would be like, I can breathe water, so I will blow air into a Sidro. Ah, they didn't need to do that. Nope. Instead, it's just... Yeah. Thanks for those, Shy and uh, Geyserik, for passing those along. Yes. But Isma is actually a good character, unlike actual harem girls. Yes, that's a good point. Uh-huh. Yep. Isma is actually yep. an amazing character. Right. Isma that's... is the best thing to come out of this mini arc. There. Exactly. And then probably Farnese's development yes. secondary. Right. The moments between the characters. The moments right. of specific. And, and that's there. the thing, like, like Isidro's development. Mm-hmm. Like I really um, feel like I really feel like the stuff with Griffith uh, is where development. is where Mira has kind of focused the the combat stuff. Yeah, and there's the combat stuff with guts, just because it's still very much an action type show. Right, but well, but, story, story, yeah, yeah, yeah. But but Mira kind of just wants to have them be the band of misfits that become a family, and you know, yeah. and, and all that stuff. I really am bummed though that Isma is probably not going to go with them. She might. She might. She I might. would love though if she went with them, but they're doing this as a no. I've, my I've now home found- is. Yeah. My home is a part of the sea. I found out who but I am. But the thing am. is, is that either way, it either way, I, what I think Berserk will do, even if she does decide to stay with the Marrow, is that it will be a decision, an actual decision, rather than just a, you know, whatever. Yeah. Um, that was funny, Aardvard. The Guts could earn 50 crowns for this. <laughs> it's a is Witcher a 3 Witcher? joke. Okay. Because when you do these side quests and stuff, the rule is that a Witcher only works for pay like they will never work for free right. mm-hmm. basically even so if like the pay like they just have to agree on the pay basically. right okay before yeah. the job is done it mm-hmm. has to be paid uh or the agreement of the amount has to be agreed up front and then paid immediately after the job is done right so yeah mm-hmm. yeah isma is a lot of fun definitely yeah. talk about farnese she's awesome yeah farnese had had so much i would say development prior to this that when we have her getting this big moment here, it makes perfect sense. It doesn't feel put out of left field. It doesn't feel like something that was like, oh, now she's casting big level spells. It's more like, no, we've been spending a lot of time here, not Mm -hmm. just with the training prior to the boat, but even on the boat. Right. Like even specifically on the boat. And I'll I'll bet actually for the people that were reading this as it came out, Mm -hmm. Farnese felt like she had been, it probably felt like Farnese had been training for a really long time. Oh yeah. Because, because the, the boat trip and had, whatnot. you know, way uh-huh. more time attached right. to it in our world. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yep. Oh, I think the section of this story is meant to show the contrast in power between Guts and Griffith, as well as how they're they're viewed by the public. Griffith sure. went up against Shiva Ganishka, basically one-shotted it, and now everyone is going to praise him as a hero and savior. Meanwhile, Guts goes up against the sea god, struggles like hell to beat it, and only a small amount of people are probably going to be aware of it. Yeah, that's that's yeah. very true. Mm-hmm. That's a very that's a very good point. Guts is not right respected, and that's or yeah. treated as positively as Griffith is. Even on it, you can't even put them on the same scale. Right, and that's kind of why I just want Guts to basically find peace rather than actually necessarily even bringing Griffith to justice. Yeah. Because I would, I would much rather see him basically settle down on a farm with Sidro and Farnese and Shirka and Serpico and everybody. Mm-hmm. Basically, just be like, 
Okay, all that crazy stuff's happening in the world, but for we, sure, we'll just we'll just you know rest here. Yeah, I love Isma. She is my daughter, and I love her. I want to see her grow up healthy. Oh yeah, yeah, she's sweet. This party is really nice, and if anything happened to them, I'd have to go and find and fight Mira myself. Yeah. Oh, people's messages are getting deleted. Oh, chat, don't be bad. The mods will exercise exercise their powers here. Mm -hmm. No shenanigans. Oh, Griffith's been set up as endgame, yes. So Guts has plot armor. Next chapter's volume, you guys are probably going to love. Yeah, cool. I'm, I'm looking forward to more world building, more, like, specific things about this world. Like, when they get to Elfhelm, like, what's that going to be like? Are we going to eventually go back to Griffith's whole mm -hmm. perspective on things and see what's going on over there? Um, in some ways, I don't want to go back to Griffith anytime soon for a bit. I want to go more in depth into Guts and Casca right. and yeah, kind of have like, them like figuring out where yeah. things are at for them. And because the stuff with the whole world, moon child thing, right? The stuff with the world is awesome. Yeah, but I am I I will like always be way more interested in the characters in a story. Yep, and the characters in Berserk are really good, and and the interactions that they have during those quiet moments are really good. Mm -hmm. I want to see that continue. Yeah. Oh, dang, didn't mention Casca in that farm scenario. Well, we need to get Casca back. That's yeah, the that's the thing. It's hard to talk about Casca yeah. because Casca mm -hmm. is not much to say. It's it's really sad, but yep. Casca's, Casca needs to be healed. Like Casca needs to be restored, and that's yeah. not happening anytime soon. Man, we are really close to 39, yep. <laughs> Griffin, I have meticulously raised an army, united all creeds beneath my flag. Slain a god and achieved my perfect dream. Guts, F this fish in particular. <laughs> yes. Pretty much. Guts is like, I'm going to swing my sword at this big thing in front of me. Yep. Because that's what I know how to do. If Puck dies, what am I going to do with my life? That's a good point. There's a lot of things in these characters here that they are keeping around for primarily their role within the party. But once things kind of get back into some bigger main quest kind of main storyline stuff here a lot of these party members might not need to be around you know they might not need to best necessarily go on guts's quest if that makes sense like guts's whole dream desire and everything has been put on hold because he's enjoying family again right like mm -hmm. like that's probably yep. the thing that needs to be talked about the most is yeah. remember that actually that's probably the best my favorite moment this whole volume was the moment where the voice spoke out to him, and it was the child was oh, saying, uh -huh. no, the, they are important. Hold on, where was that? Uh, that was pretty early, I think, actually. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Look. And then, that's right. You know this. You yeah. mustn't lose it. Mm -hmm. You mustn't destroy it. Because here's the thing I think that, that's really important here. Mm -hmm. They used the lose for Casca because he has lost Casca in some ways. Right. Mm -hmm. And you put you mustn't destroy the, on family. the, the family because right. Guts views himself as the one that destroyed the band of the hawk. Right. Well and, and he blames himself for and, that. And with the stuff that came after yep. the the eclipse, it could have just been him, Rickert, and mm -hmm. uh and, and Casca, and they could have just, you know, just lived in that cave yeah but he destroyed that yeah he did yeah. he did i also like if you look at them all here mm -hmm. look at the darkness creeping up on all of them here yep uh-huh yeah right yep, yep. I, I, ugh, there's so many little details oh. in the art that's going to make this so much fun to reread and stuff because mm -hmm. i feel like there's already like 15 to 20 volumes that i specifically want to go back and read you know Mm. Like, like ones that sure. I'm like, okay, I want to read this like set of 10 pages and I want to read this set of 10 pages so I can like hyper skim through these like highlight moments. But then there are these little moments like this on the moment to moment stuff where I'm like, okay, yeah, okay. Right. It's what makes, that's good. It what makes, it's what makes, it's what makes the berserker armor and that whole conflict have impact because if it was yeah. just guts, then you yeah. could go for something else, but like, you know, do it in a different way. But, but it, it is kind of an edgy power-up mechanic. You right, know? exactly. So it's the fact that it brings it back to this idea of family amidst yep. all this turmoil. That's what makes it so good. Yep. <sighs> oh, uh, sometimes you got to make an arc for the action fans versus the emotional or plot fans. Uh, Maybe. Yeah, yeah, I see what you're saying. 
but what? I don't think that's actually a thing that Berserk has ever really done. Like, like right. if you think back on all the past arcs of Berserk, right. a lot of it is extremely character focused to the point where they leave guts entirely. Like, if you think about it, other than the Golden Age arc, mm -hmm. a lot of the other arcs focus entirely on other characters for huge chunks of time, and there's no action focus at all, and that's kind of rampant throughout it. And the action is more of just a when Guts is, you know, at odds with his environment. <laughs> sure. He, he turns to violence. That's his thing. Uh -huh. Yeah. But it's not really a thing where the arcs are separated by action versus character, in my opinion. I'm just, I'm just mm -hmm. saying that's that's something I, I kind of I kind of disagree with. What do you think would happen if Casca comes back? What do you want to happen? That's a good question, I mean, Jacob. What do you What do you want to happen with Casca? I want them to just settle down somewhere and yeah, find peace. Yeah, the thing is that they could like. They, like, they still could. It would be it would be almost impossible with Guts in the way he's... Well, Guts would have no, to forsake the Berserker no, he, armor. But the thing is, he could. That's the thing. Because yes. what he's doing right now is he's doing it for Casca, right? Right. Whereas before, because we had that whole conflict where he realized, oh yeah, I abandoned Casca to go save my own vengeance, right? Mm -hmm. I'm not going to do that anymore. You know? Yeah. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah, even the stuff with Wild had the emotional stuff with Griffith, yeah. That's true. The closest thing that we got in this arc, I would say, would be the stuff with Farnes. And then just yeah. Isma in general being awesome. But, yeah. Yeah, for sure. There's also a lot of comedy in this little section of the arc as yes. well. Yes, yes. Uh, because Isidro was pretty put was put pretty front and center. In oh, yeah. Yep. And he's got that kind of blend of action and comedy, but a little bit right. more so comedy than seriousness. Because mm -hmm. he's Puck. He's basically Puck's, you know, mech at mm -hmm. this point. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Okay, so we're going to wrap things up here. Um, uh, yes, the, the Sea God arc is not over yet. That That's true. We still haven't right. killed this thing yet. Mm -hmm. But the thing is, we have allies. And we need to deal with the aftermath when it happens. Mm -hmm. But Jacob, now that we have basically, you know, allies in this, you could say that battle lines have been drawn, you know, for the One might uh, say that. Although one might say that, this, that was uh, done this conflict. earlier with uh with Griffisu and his whole takeover and whatnot. Right. But yes, battle lines have been draw up, not drawn up. Now, there's no Amazons in this story, so I can't make that pun. Right. But we do but, have a we do have a goo here. We have a goo. That's right. And, and we have basically our, yes. our fey creatures that are going to sacrifice themselves as they should. <laughs> there aren't goos or fey creatures in battle lines. <laughs> none. None. No. It's a sci-fi. It's a sci-fi. Um, exactly. But yeah, my amazing sci-fi book, Battle Lines, is available on Amazon. There is a link that you can probably find. Oh, yeah, I can, post I can, in there. I can share it. I mean, we're 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 shilling this as much as possible because like there, guys, I think it's also in the description of the Attack on Titan video because the the Amazon link is so clunky. It's like it's huge. Yeah, it's pretty clunky. We won't link it in here, but check it out. Jacob um, finished a book. He's a yeah. published author now. It's pretty cool. Yeah, and uh, lots of people are reading it now on our Discord. Mm -hmm. Which, if you are a subscriber, Twitch sub because Amazon Prime is a thing, mm -hmm. and Twitch Prime allows you to be a sub with that for free. So uh, check that out, and uh, yeah. there's a link to our Discord in the subscriber room. Right. But if you're wanting a link to the Battle Lines thing specifically, then there is also uh, one in the Attack on Titan video. You need to start putting that in the other videos too. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So y'all, next streams are on Thursday. That's Jacob doing Dota 2 gaming. That's right. Hopefully and, not dying too much, although let's be real. And Come you're on. getting back into the swing of things pretty I'm, well. Yes, I'm trying out some new heroes. Cool. Like, you know, not Figuring just... out the new meta. Exactly, yeah. yeah. Nice. So um, all streams are at 3 p.m. Pacific time. We've got right. that on Thursday. We've got me playing The Witcher 3 on Friday at 3 p.m. Pacific time pacific standard time mm -hmm. uh, i'm going through the hearts of stone dlc which is amazing by the way and then we've got our podcast on monday at 3 p.m pacific time we're right. going to be talking about some of the anime that we've recently finished yes, up on because we're finishing stuff and that means new stuff starting lots not, not, of crazy good stuff yeah there. so mm -hmm. uh yeah hope to see you all in a future stream but until then we're semblance of sanity i'm caleb i'm jacob and we'll see you all next time Ooh.
Boy. Yeah, that's probably my favorite thing about being on the Discord and, and going into the spoilers battle lines thing and oh, seeing yeah. all these reviews as people oh, yeah. and stuff. And I'm like, yeah. oh, now yeah. these people are reacting to mm -hmm. your stuff. It's weird, coming full circle, yeah. <laughs> although, <laughs> although I suppose I like I'm not reacting to battle lines myself, so there is that. Yeah. But oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. But yeah, seeing them react to big twists and turns oh, yeah, and like, character moments. It's, my favorite part is. The